Sight, new paint. Hold on, big sir. Y'all know how this is new paint. It's of, over. They're out of production, homie. <laughs> they're 150 bucks as All it is. Us. What's up, man? You know, just hanging out here with my boy Billy, Johnny, Kobe, oh, you Rodney. Know, and oh, what's going, going on, on here? Oh yeah. Oh hello, Mr. Buffet. Yeah, number two. Well, I think I think I can go Facebook Live. <laughs> I don't even know what to say, dude. What's up, y'all? How's everybody living? I hope you guys are enjoying the show because I can't elaborate enough how special the last hour of my life has been. Look at this thing. My boy Johnny is double fisty right now. Hey, don't worry. This is how he double fists Liam right Knight here. Got the sh oh, ah! <laughs> great. <laughs> Incredible. You know, there, there are certain... There are different styles and techniques we use to catch these fish. High on my list was casting at them with an artificial lure. And I've got two already today doing such exactly that. And to me, it's beyond just catching the fish. You know, it's really about challenging myself and challenging the crew to even put me in a position to have a shot at that. Because this is a much lower percentage technique than fishing a live bait or even dragging a fake flying fish on the yummy balloon kite system that Billy's mastered. So I couldn't be any happier and I got four of my boys on the boat with me. You know, even the homies that are working, man. Like, we got history. We got history. We got history. We making history. Right here. Sick. Sick. Oh yeah. If you guys haven't noticed, I've been doing this non-stop for a cool minute. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, damn. Hey, what's up, Mr. Bluefin? He said we got a, uh... Pop the hooks out of this bad boy, pull out the guts, bleed it, get it on ice in the kill bag, and uh, try and put another one in the bag. Wow. Oh, look at that bacon. Oh, man. Let's go. I'm dropping a yummy on a bacon. Yeah. All right. So, these lures are built and designed with these giant trophy fish in mind, and thankfully they are with the extra heavy gear. This is a wood bait. This is a handmade bait from Japan. They reinforce it with a through wire construction, and thank goodness they do, because these fish are so powerful that it's tweaking the rigging harness out of the wood. Wow. Get its head in there, we'll slide them right in. Okay, I'm just pull that up. There you go. The nice. Nice. Give a really You ready to eat? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So this is a technique most of the fleet been using to catch a giant bluefin tuna the last two years. This is called this is called the Billy K Yummy Flyer. What we do is we skip this guy right on the surface on a kite. Market. And we're marking! More, more, more. You can shoot with the car, huh? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So what we're looking at right here 
we're all super stoked about. All these arches, you see the ones with these little lines that look like squiggly little worms on the screen. Every single one of those is a giant bluefin tuna. Looks just like small melt bass. <laughs> Except a little more exciting because they're a little bit bigger. So yeah, that's a good sign. That's exactly what you want to see. So this is exactly what you want to see when you're idling through a new area. Check that out. Look at that, Holly. So what we're looking for right now is a huge explosion. It's like a huge 200, 300 pound sumo wrestler just making a big old splash right next to the yummy. And then the second thing you look for is that flag to come down and make sure it has it. So this style of fishing is so exciting for me. Every time we have someone new out here, they've never seen it before. And you know what? By the way things are looking right now, we're going to get bit. So the reason why we're doing this is we're trying to mimic a flying fish, you know? For whatever reason, the bluefin don't really like, you know, trolling with, you know, your line in the water, you know, very traditional style of trolling for like yellowfin tuna, albacore, and stuff like that. So we have two rods. One rod is connected to a kite, and the second rod is connected to a clip with a flying fish, a rubber flying fish, that's supposed to mimic it. And we're trying to duplicate that right now. And the fish just get really aggressive, chase after it, and then they crash right on it. And that's what makes this tuna fishing so exciting to see a two, 300 pound tuna jump out of the water and jump on this plastic Michael Phelps, as I like to call it. So we're, we're here right now on the grounds, we're in the right spot. Uh, we're a little bit early, but you know what? Just give a little bit more time, and I'm sure, you know, we'll see some amazing things happen today. So stay tuned. First day on the Pacific Ocean for me personally here today. Uh, got to witness this guy over here crack two bluefin tuna on a freaking popper. Uh, that's something that, like, I don't know. It's pretty stinking cool. I'm a big fan of topwater fish myself, as most of everybody should be. Uh, so to be able to watch a fish like this caliber with this much power come out of the water at 100 miles an hour and to get Oliver almost watch Oliver get pulled over the railing is pretty cool too because he's always complaining about how you know fish aren't strong enough so it's pretty awesome it's been a lot of fun we cracked two of them so far today um, and uh, now we got the magic rig going the yummies flying stay tuned to get some awesome stuff about to happen it's a little early we got the right stuff in the works Gonna be a good day. And look at this guy, look at him. We got him all decked out. He's all West Coast. The West right Coast, now. man. I got two. Oh, my bad. I got, I got the boots, man. <laughs> I got the boots. Like, this is West Coast right here. <laughs> good stuff, baby. So, over my shoulder right now, I mean, you can't see it from the camera, but there's a, uh, a Navy helicopter kind of flying around. San Clemente Island is a military island, you know, Navy facility, but they do a lot of live fire testing, a lot of training, a lot of things that our military, you know, conducts and practices right here. So they do have a schedule and sometimes they do change the schedule, which is exactly what they're doing right now. And we just got to abide by it, you know, um, you got to be respectful. You got to listen to them before they come down and, and manually tell you with their helicopter, you know what I mean? So. Um, we're just gonna continue to keep on moving northwest. I'm sure we're gonna find a little bit of batch of fish. And uh, we're just gonna keep on trolling the yummy. So let's see what happens. Shout out to the Navy. Shout out to the Navy. All right, so uh, you know, we're heading up the island here and some conditions has changed. And you know, one of the key things about being a good fisherman, and I'm not saying I'm a good fisherman, but, uh, but you have to learn to adapt to the different changes in the environment and, and things that you see out here. So right now we're seeing a lot less wind and it's not really optimal to fly that plastic uh, flying fish. So what we're doing now is we're actually kind of setting up to use a real flying fish, but it's a dead one. You know, we're kind of trolling it really slow, um, just depending on uh, what's, what's kind of going on here. It's not really prime time yet. Prime time is at five to like 8.30 o'clock, you know? I mean, and, and that time the fish really get active. We don't know why they do that, but we just know they do. And uh, we're gonna be, you know, position ourselves to be able to um, do the best we can at that hour. And hopefully get a little bit lucky. And it's always better to be lucky than to be good. Let me tell you that right now. 
Yeah, the thing is, like, there's not even enough wind to take the line out. All right, then, then uh, throttle forward. I mean, this is almost balloon, man. You know what? We got the helium. I say let's use it. I like it. Make it the call. What? What do you mean? Whoa, directly to the to the line. Cause this this is no wind. Look at that! Look at that thing. You know, you can't be stingy about your helium, you know? We're filling up another balloon. Uh, this time we're flying the dead flying fish. A little different conditions as they mentioned a little bit earlier. So, um, here we go. Big for the fish, man. I guarantee you the thing's huge. Hey, back, I love balloons. You guys ever watch that uh, show I'm addicted to balloons? Or I love balloons? No, we're not weird like that. <laughs> it's not my show. Is that one down there? That's a turd. Dude, that's how like a 20 pixel fish is a fan. Fan. Dude, that is Slow down a little bit, Billy, so you get up. There we go. Oh my gosh, right now we're about to pull up on some big foaming bluefin. These are all 200 plus. I've never seen it like this before. You know, we got the kite going in the back. We haven't dropped it yet, but I'm about to set up all of it right on these fish right here. It's a whole square mile. Oh my gosh. Get ready, boys. Get ready. Get ready. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I know. I know. I know. We're not, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. Don't worry, I'll set you up. It's a whole square mile. It's big fish, all big fish. But look, look, the one on your 11 o'clock is a big school. It's a big school. We're gonna get one right here, boys. We're gonna get one right here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely incredible. I've been out here for months and months and months and if not the last few years, I've never seen it like this. This is absolutely incredible. Man, you're in for a treat. I'm trying to reserve on the F-bombs here. I need to get these fish. Oh my gosh. All right, it's time, it's time you turn around. Past those birds sitting on the water. Got 
Guys, we got we got fish busting everywhere here. Um, you know, they're they're a little bit boat shy, but uh, let, let me show you what I see here. Oh man, we're on Facebook Live. Welcome to the Billy K Fishing Show. All right, got a camera right there. Look, they're busting everywhere. Right there. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere right now. Oh my gosh. I, I just gotta position the boat right. I mean, they're kind of down right now. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me know if I can cast, Cap. I'm patient. I know. Yep, no worries. Oh, oh my god. 